You see the catch fart, Captain? The what? Anything, Captain? Do north of here. Oh, great. Whoa, 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 whoa! Let's leave it at home shots. What's that weasel up to? She tanker to windward, Captain. You can be sure he's got something up his sleeve. Um, how do I catch up to him? Manowars. It's a bloody armada. I knew he was up to something. And he's turned to fight us. We're in it now, Captain. Okay. Let's switch to... So we fight, Mr. Faulkner. Board the Randolph. Sink the rest. Take out the Manowar within a given time. Destroy the Randolph mess with a single broadside. the cannons No, no, the other one. Oh, 
Come on, aim! Aim! Yeah. Our main mast is down. We have that bottle berry over a barrel. <laughs> She's ours, men. Prepare to board. Fiddle is mine. Ah, kill only Biddle. Okay, you didn't say that. You already killed a few. Come on! Oh yeah, we're dueling, huh? Your misplaced sense of justice is pathetic. You should have never set foot outside your little village. Come on. Stab it. Mr. Kenway will reward me greatly for ridding him of you. Stab him. Oh. So it's a uh, chase. Got it. Mr. Kenway will reward me greatly for ridding him of you. Stab him while he's on the ground. Your misplaced sense of justice is pathetic. You should have never set foot outside your little village. Why don't you stab him? Mr. Kenway will reward me greatly for ridding him of you. <laughs> Tenacious! Smart! <laughs> Your reign over the colonial coast has come to an end. <laughs> Is that why you hunted me? Because you thought me an enemy to the cause? <laughs> You're every bit the fool I was told. You brought pain and suffering upon innocent people for nothing but personal gain. Pain. Suffering. I set them free. Weeded out the dissenters and... Empowered the Patriots. Uh -huh. So what if I was named Admiral? The revolution needs one, and I was the best man for the job. No. The only man. If not for me, the Continental Navy would remain but a handful of rafts. For all your vision, you assassins are blind to the truth. Enough. Wait. Let the Randolph die with me don't take her as a prize please please I want no quarter just to sink with my ship no I'm taking it the hell with you I'm taking it I can't believe you mean to leave the Randolph 
She's a mighty vessel, Captain, and one of Biddle. You show him mercy in the face of... Well, I guess that's that, then. A tad overdramatic, if you ask me. Still, a waste of a formidable ship. How's about a cheer for the boys, then, eh? <laughs> Victory for the Akira! For her glory! Hip, hip! Hurrah! Hurrah! Hip, hip, hurrah! Hurrah! Hip, hip, hurrah! <laughs> <laughs> I've been a wild rover for many a year And I've spent all my money on whiskey and beer <laughs> <sighs> Okay Anything I might have missed? No, oh, looks all clear. One deal, maybe? Thank you. Nothing here. I think my, my uh, convoys are back. Catnip. Who's using catnip? Left flower. Barley bells and lie. Bread requires flour, milk, and eggs. Old medicine is catnip and bottles and barley. Catnip and bottles. Catnip and charcoal. Makes sense. Iron and lumber. Convoys are back.
Cool. That was a thirty-eight thousand, and I'm a thirty-two thousand. Nothing here. Anything in Boston? For some reason. What the hell are those? What do I do with those? And yes, Georgia. He's a level six captain. He's a level nine general. Oh wait, maybe I can send you on dangerous missions. Seventy-five percent. New York. New Jersey. Trenton. That's 70? Because of the assist. Okay, go for it. Okay, I'm for New York. Most of the mission nearby, and the Nominec. Is that a puppy? No, it's a doggo. Land convert to Boston. What can I do for you? Um, sell stuff? All the stuff? Blunt weapons. Gun stock club. Really? Heavy weapons, naval axe, but it's worse. Firearms, it can button. Why? We have the double barrel. The bunny hammer handle, double. Oh, that's what he wants. And the hardened steel hammer head. Baltimore. Nope. 
זה על אחיין. חלק ניו יורק בטח. ניו יורק צ'סט. אוקיי. Captain's on a warpath for that deserter. What's his name? Big man or some such thing? Big Dave. Did in a whole unit escaping, they say. Dave's in for a rough ride, seems to me. Nah, no he won't. Okay, so that was the homestead mission. Let's go. And contract. Climb it. That's a nasty jump. You must be him. I've been waiting too long. I know who the traitors are. And they're bringing lists of the Patriot leaders around here to the Redcoats right now. Find a way to swap this fake list with the real ones. And the Rebellion can fight on. Give me the target. On. Oh wait, it was an almanac. Oh, nicely convenient ladder. Hang on, before you swallow me, let me get the coil. Good, keep each other busy. 
Come on. Back on task. Wait, I didn't drop the courier. Excuse me, that's mine. Stop running up walls like an idiot. Okay, there's an almanac. Jump. Excuse me, come on, Dry goods, feed, salt, and other sundries available in bulk from Rob. Come and get Uh. Okay, let's get the box. We need to distribute these blankets soon. Good riddance to these beggars. The city's better off without them. Did you rub them proper? Yes, never fear. They are coated in the disease. Good. Let's... <laughs> Done, or do you want to keep on going? Get away from the fire.
Hang on Tomahawk. Yes. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. Excuse me, come here. Now I can fight. Fine, let's go. Ooh, 44,000. Oh, he's the best on If that's a fort, right? I should be able to take the fort. Not from here. Fine, I'll take the fort later. Alternate methods. We need to know what the Loyalists are planning, if we're to put an end to this. I've tried, but the soldiers themselves are told nothing now, only to await orders from above. Keep digging. Come find me when you have something worth sharing. We're so close to victory. A few more well-placed attacks and we'll be able to put an end to the civil war and be rid of the crown. What do you intend? Well, nothing at the moment, since we're completely in the dark. I thought the Templars had eyes and ears everywhere. Oh, we did. Until you started cutting them off. Your contact <laughs> said orders from above. It tells us exactly what we need to do. Track down the Loyalist commanders. Yep. Follow him. Okay. Yes, now what? Trinity Church. It's unfortunate you're too late to see Trinity Church before it, it burned. Construction on New Church won't start until 1788. Trinity is a bit of an institution in New York, especially in the late 18th century. The church founded both the Trinity School and King's College, which later became Columbia University. St. Paul's Chapel is another offshoot of the church. You can't get a better indication of how loyalist New York was than that. It had two branches of the same Anglican church operating within blocks of one another. Captain William Kidd, yes, the famous pirate, lent some of his ship's equipment to help build the original church, the one you see here burned, which was nice of him. Many people these days consider many pirates to have been rather progressive socialists with community-minded consciousnesses, uh, which I rather feel takes away from their mystique. It's like finding out Genghis Khan had solar panels. 
Anyway, Kid even reserved his pew here, though he left New York before he ever got to sit in it. The church building in modern-day New York is the third Trinity building, when it was finished in 1846. It was the tallest building in New York. Of course, it's at the corner of Wall Street, so you can imagine how tall it looks now compared to the local skyscrapers, showing you who really has the influence now. Trinity School. The school opened in 1709 as a charity school, meaning it was free to attend and the students would have been from poor families. At the time, most well-to-do children would have been educated at home. The school was originally in the bell tower of the Trinity Church, but by the time you're seeing it, it's moved across the street. This is the only school that remained open during the British occupation of New York, possibly because it was endowed by Trinity Church, which was loyalist. Of course, Trinity also funded King's College, which was, close and, which was closed and used a military hospital, but universities are known, f are known liberal hotbeds. After the Revolutionary War, the government started to focus on free public education, and the city eventually stopped funding church schools, preferring to fund secular ones. Trinity School became a private preparatory school, which it still is. It's prestigious, expensive, and has been accepting students for 300 years. That's a long time for the colonies. Of course, Eton was founded in England in 1440, that's 20 years before Ezio was born, and around 50 years from Col before Columbus discovered in America that Etonians would enjoy a proud tradition of looking down on four centuries to come. Where'd you go? What are you on about? Where are you going? Have you considered the proposal? I'm unconvinced. To reinforce them would leave New York exposed. It's hard enough maintaining order with our current numbers. Cut in half. Yet if we do not join with them, they risk defeat. And then what? Well, they should have come by sea. <laughs> Talking in circles. <laughs> We're nothing watching as we are. Then what do you propose we do? March in there and demand answers? Well, <laughs> yes. Ah! Ambush! Connor? Little help here? <sighs> Leave the commanders alive, Connor. We can interrogate them. human shields. Okay, no one said that. Come on, you're the last one. Yeah. Well, 
bring them back to my quarters at Fort George and see what secrets they might share. <sighs> really? Well, you'd best get after him then. You go. I will watch the prisoners. No, you do it. Why no. me? You do it. Because I said so. Now go. No, you do it. Uh, you should stand up for yourself. What else? Tackle the target from above. Come on, move it. לא הכל, חתיכה. Get him, get him! Tackle the target from above. I'm trying. What the hell was that? Kill him, kill him, kill him.
Jump and kill him. Just going around. You freaking genius. Okay, doing it right this time. Stop him! J jump and tackle him! Why aren't you tackling him? mistake. said move <sighs> wait wait I i'll tell you anything you want That's anything point. only don't make we just have some there. questions for you cross that threshold and i'm a dead man there you are connor i was worried you might have gotten lost come along then move you like to push me before <laughs> 
Fort George. This fort is in seven named chairs. It started in 1625. It's Fort Amsterdam, protecting the original Dutch settlement of New Amsterdam. Since then, it's been known as Fort James and Fort William, before changing sex to Fort Anne and swapping back in the 18th century to Fort George. When the Revolutionary War ended, Fort George was torn down, perhaps predictably, given that this latest name was in honor of the king. Should really have stuck with Fort Anne. Everybody loves an Anne. City Hall in New York starting in 1702, also city jail until the new goal opened in 1759. Despite New York's historical le loyalist leanings, the building has a decidedly rebel slanted past. Delegates from nine of the colonies met here to coordinate protests against the Stamp Act. That meant representatives from the British instituted legislature were protesting when British Parliament thought best, a truly huge step at the time. After the Constitution was ratified in 1789, Congress began to meet here at the, in the building renamed Federal Hall. George Washington was inaugurated as president on the balcony on April 30, 1789. Oops, sorry, spoiler alert. Yes, he wins the war and becomes president. And then it turns out he was ghost all along. The building was expanded in 1788, but torn down in 1812. Despite its name, the modern-day Federal Hall National Memorial in New York was never actually Federal Hall. I'm just enjoying this. You're walking too slow. Are they already dead? What are the British planning? to march from Philadelphia. That city's finished. New York's the key. They'll double our numbers, push back the rebels. When do they begin? Two days from now. June 18th. I must warn Washington. You see? That wasn't so very difficult now, was it? I I've told you everything. N now let me go. Of course. The other two said the same. It must be true. You killed him. You killed all of them. Why? They'd have warned the loyalists. You could have held them until the fight was done. What? And with precious time and money on their care? What would be the point? They'd given up everything they knew. I'll meet you at Valley Forge. Why would you go to Valley Forge? I think I'm gonna do what George Washington asked. After I get the Solomon Act. Come on. <sighs> okay. No, no, I won't. Oh, someone needs a letter. Come on.
Okay. Let her know. Thank you. Where the hell do you think you're going? Get, get. I'm sorry. To carry you. Oh, the oil, goddammit. Oh no. Come on. me I'm trying to help a sick person About time you showed up. What are you doing? I mean to start my inoculations. It's the most effective way to prevent the disease. Not a worry. The pity people are so damn stupid. Hey, Connor. Mm. Oh, What's wrong with you? An attack is coming. Are you ready for a fight? Always. You tell me where you want me, and I'll make sure not a single man gets through. Killed your fortune guards. Well, which ones? Ambush ability. Civilians, get out. Thank you. Okay, I want that one box here. Give me this. Put it over there. Yep. Should be only that's the only other entrance.
now. Thanks. The assassins have long Ooh, since branched out across the globe. The colonies are no exception. The man you killed was a Templar. And here I was thinking you were helping me. I must say, I'm honored. <laughs> if you ever need my help again, don't hesitate. Ambush. Good an ambush that will kill incoming enemies. Uh -huh. Oh, now we have three records. That's nice. 